Hi everyone, I'm Giant Spain, and welcome back to my Let's Play Chrono Trigger Edition Part 8. Um, picking up where we left off, uh, we're escaping from the dungeons of this, uh, this castle where we were uh, wrongfully convicted of a crime uh, we had nothing to do with uh, by, the cha by the evil chancellor, apparently. Um, we just got an axe to grind against us. Maybe he's a demon again. Uh, he was a demon... Uh, 400, a demon disguised himself as him 400 years ago, so I guess, it, you know, could have happened again. Um, let's see here. What do we got here? Uh, what's that? Oh, just some bones. Not worrying about that right now. Okay. Gotta, gotta, gotta hustle, gotta get ourselves up and out of here and escape. Ain't got, ain't got time to be getting executed. Time to knock off a couple more of these shields. It's funny too, because they usually uh, make themselves vulnerable at least once before they attack, from what I've seen. So, usually you can do these fights and not take any damage at all. So you're just patient. Alright. Score. Yeah. Getting, getting rich escaping this dungeon. I don't want to go here yet. Got to explore one more side of the dungeon first. Let's see here. What do we got here? Nothing. Nothing. Uh, that open. The opening right there, by the way, lets you climb down to one of the rooms that uh, you couldn't get the door completely open in. So I don't feel like doing it right now because uh, you gotta scale your way down the the side of the wall. Uh, it's kind of neat, you know, it's a nice little side trip, but you don't really get a whole lot out of the room, so it's not really worth the time that it takes. I like how the guards look all big and tough. And Chrono comes out and he's like, Score! Boom! All dead! And I wish they would imprison me with my, my weapons in some of these uh, modern games. This is the first, the first time I've ever had that happen. Let's see. Look at my inventory a little bit here. He knocked himself out. Oh, Nancy, you're here to save me again? Man, you are proving to be super awesome. I apologize once again for any reservations I had about you before. Let's read this top secret document. Of course, I'll read the top secret document. Dragon Tank? I don't like the way that sounds. Alright then, well... Let's go... Let's go see what's going on. Oh, that doesn't sound good. That does not sound good at all. Mm, I don't know. Ow! Well then. Hello there. Personally, I like that. You, you do have to kill the head first, uh, otherwise it just keeps doing the healing thing. Uh, personally, I like the cyclone slash it so that it spends more of its time trying to heal than attack you.
otherwise, uh, I think just be like, cool, cool, and you can do a lot of this other stuff, but it'll still attack you periodically. If you're able to damage the entire tank, then has to, well, has to, but triggers the, the healing pin from the head, so it winds up uh, getting less during that time. Yeah, it keeps spin cutting. The tank really, really likes Nancy. Don't worry, hang in there, Nancy. Don't let anything bad happen to you. Those are weak rockets. This dragon tank needs to reevaluate its coaches. <laughs> but yeah, the, uh, the killer order is head, wheels, and then run. Because you have to get the head so it doesn't heal, and you know, once the head's dead and whatnot, when it runs over you, that the particular attack does more damage than the one body that is shooting the rockets, so. Priorities, head, wheels, body. No! Dick, he just plows me over like a steamroller. I'm starting to get a lot of health here. I'm not heal soon. Dick Dragon Tank. There we go. Your head is gone. Aha! That's right. So I forgot a lot of I think the head makes it fire resistant, so I keep moving the head. Fire winds up doing more damage, but still not as much because you know, it's a tank, so it's heavy armor. This dick's gonna keep running me over. It's alright, don't worry. I got something for him. Oh no, I shoot lasers! to finish the body off. The uh, big fat tank. Ain't no, ain't no, ain't no threat to nobody. There we go. Okay. Nailed it. Huh. There you go. Get it, Chrome. No, they got the dragon tank. Yeah, let's fix it, guys. Uh, 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 ah! Oh, there we go. Oh, the, and you see, these, this is how I know the Chancellor's actually beat down a good guy. Because, I mean, look at him. Him and his buddies made a bridge for us so that we could finish escaping after we blew his, you know, his tank up. It's pretty neat why we got blown up, but he still helped us get it. So, I don't know. I think deep down the Chancellor is going to get it, but he just has trouble expressing his emotions. They're escaping! As some people would say, never understood that. So you should be escape. Come on. Oh, sure it is. Escape! Oh no, they're escaping! Ah. These guys try to cock block you. They don't actually attack, they just run around and like, get in your way. But, but, you listen, you listen to the princess. Damn right, of course. Oh, what is this? Who's this coming to ruin our day? The Chancellor. Oh, daddy's here to ruin the day.
course, Daddy's going back to the channel, so. Bunch of old white men always sticking together. Common sense, yes. Not always so common, by the way. Oh, the spot is one people. Typical rebellious teenager. Uh, oh no, the Chancellor is literally hopping mad. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I haven't been making enough puns today. <laughs> and the track team's gonna follow us through the forest. Because they have to break in their sweet new blue track suits. They're not gonna attack us because you know they're track team. But they're just gonna kinda follow us around. Uh, dead end with Nancy here. No, no, the Chancellor's here. He followed us. Track team led him to us. Completely unacceptable. Hey everybody, let's go! Escape! Going through time. Mm. Yeah. Maybe chance for a boost. Well. Um, and now we arrive somewhere else. Uh, looks kind of futuristic though. So. New time period to explore. Um, this is going to be concluding uh, this episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger uh, Part 8. We will see you next time on Part 9. Thank you all for watching and have an awesome day.